introduce to our guests the members of Executive Council. Chief Justice, I would now ask the members to rise and take the oath of the Executive Council. Brian Mason, David Egan, Darren Billis, Joe Cece, Margaret McQuaid Boyd, Sarah Hoffman, Kathleen Ganley, Laurie Sigurdsson, O'Neill Collier, Shannon Phillips, and Irfan Sabir. I would ask you to administer the oath of executive council to these individuals. Members, please repeat, so help me God, for I solemnly affirm at the close of the oath according to your choosing. You, Brian Mason, David Egan, Darren Billis, Joe Cece, Margaret McQuaid Boyd, Sarah Hoffman, Kathleen Ganley, Lori Sigurdsson, O'Neill Collier, Shannon Phillips, and Irfan Saber, do solemnly promise and swear that you will serve Her Majesty truly and faithfully in the place of her council in this Her Majesty's province of Alberta. You will keep close and secret all such matters as shall be treated, debated, and resolved on in executive council without publishing or disclosing the same or any part thereof by word, writing, or any otherwise to any person out of the same council, but to such only as be of the council. And yet if any matter so propounded, treated, and debated in any such executive council shall touch any particular person sworn of the same council, upon any such matter as shall in any wise concern his loyalty and fidelity to the Queen's Majesty, you will in no wise open the same to him, but keep it secret, as you would from any person, until the Queen's Majesty's pleasure be known in that behalf. You will in all things to be moved, treated, and debated in any such executive council faithfully, honestly, and truly declare your mind and opinion to the honor and benefit of the Queen's Majesty and the good of her subjects without partiality or exception of persons, in no wise forbearing so to do from any manner of respect, favor, love, need, displeasure, or dread of any person or persons whatsoever. In general, you will be vigilant, diligent, and circumspect in all your doings touching the Queen's Majesty's affairs, all of which matters and things you will faithfully observe and keep as a good counselor ought to do to the utmost of your power, will, and discretion. Members will now subscribe to the oath by signing the Executive Council Roll Book.
Chief Justice, I will now call forward Brian Mason to take the oath as Minister of Infrastructure and Minister of Transportation. I, Brian Mason, do solemnly and sincerely promise skill and knowledge, execute the powers and trust reposed in me as Minister of Infrastructure and Minister of Transportation for the province of Alberta. I solemnly affirm. as Minister of Education yeah. and Minister of Culture and Tourism. Thank you. I, David Egan, do solemnly and sincerely promise and swear that I will duly and faithfully and to the best of my skill and knowledge execute the powers and trusts reposed in me as Minister of Education and Minister of Culture in Tourism for the province of Alberta. Affairs and Minister of Service, Alberta. I, Darren Billis, do solemnly and sincerely promise and swear that I will duly and faithfully, and to the best of my skill and knowledge, execute the powers and trust reposed in me as Minister of Municipal Affairs and Minister of Service Alberta for the province of Alberta, so help me God. Joe 
please step forward to take the oath as President of Treasury Board and Minister of Finance. I, Joe Cece, do solemnly and sincerely promise and swear that I will duly and faithfully and to the best of my skill and knowledge execute the powers and trust reposed in me as President of Treasury Board and Minister of Finance for the province of Alberta. Please step forward to take the oath as Minister of Energy. I, Margaret McCoy Boy, do solemnly and sincerely promise and swear that I will do duly and faithfully and to the best of my skill and knowledge execute the powers and trust reposed in me as Minister of Energy for the province of Alberta, so help me God. I, Sarah Hoffman, do solemnly and sincerely promise and swear that I will duly and faithfully, and to the best of my skill and knowledge, execute the powers and trusts reposed to me as Minister of Health and Minister of Seniors for the province of Alberta. I so affirm. Yay!